Hello, everybody. It's me. It's me. It's good old Santa Shaggy. Yeah. Oh, did you miss me? I bet not, because Easter Elf did an awesome job this week with this week's update video. Oh, she did an awesome job. Oh, good job. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I needed a little bit of a break so I can work on a few things, and she took over the reins, and she just knocked that ball right out of the ballpark. Yeah, she hit a home run. Yeah, she did everything she was supposed to. She talked about the Elf of the Week. She talked about the Question of the Week. She talked about the next live show. She talked about a couple other things that she was supposed to, and she did an awesome job. And I would like to say thank you, thank you, thank you, Easter Elf. I needed some time to plan a few things on the computer oh, and talk to a few people. And get some things lined up for the upcoming events that I just can't wait to tell you about today. Can't tell you right now. Huh? But, awesome job. Let's see. She talked about the honorary elf of the week. And let me just say, congratulations, uh, any proud mommy buffin. Oh, that's a fun word, fun name to say. Huh? But we see you liking a lot of stuff, and we see you you almost like everything, actually. And we see you coming from time to time. Keep it up, girl. You are rocking it. <laughs> yeah. And if you want to be the next week's Elf of the Week, all you got to do is like every, all the posts and, and just keep keep coming back for more. <laughs> yeah. And who knows? You might be next week's Elf of the Week. As far as Question of the Week, uh, uh, see, Sheriff did forget to talk about last week's question of the week, which was, what type of tree do you put up? And most of you guys said <clears throat> said that you hang up or put up artificial trees instead of real life trees, which is cool. Where you guys are saving the environment a little bit, and in the, today's society, a lot more people are leaning more towards artificial trees, and that's fine. I I use an artificial tree. In fact, I've got two artificial trees in my house. And they should be coming up very, 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 very soon. Ah, but uh, I've got to pace myself a little bit. Oh. And she also, she that, that question last week was from Kim Middleton. This week's question of the week came from none other than Easter Elf herself. And she wanted to know, what do you look for when you go through the Christmas department? And she said that she looks for the ornaments. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's a neat thing to look for. I, I tend to go look for, I collect little stockings, I, I hang them around one of my doors, and I, I try to find the uh, one each year, a different one each year with a different cartoon character, which you don't see as much anymore, but different cartoon characters, like I've got some Transformer ones, I've got some Rudolph ones, I've got a Grinch one, I've got a Christmas Story one, I've got a bunch of them, and I just hang them around one of my doors. This year, I, I'm having a hard time finding them, finding one that I really, really like. So I'll, I'll, I'll keep my eye out. But I also like to look at the lights. I like to look at the Christmas trees. I like to look at the Christmas cookies. I like to look at the Christmas candy, the Christmas stuffed animals, the Christmas hats, the Christmas shirts, the Christmas... I just like looking at everything in the Christmas department, Christmas music, Christmas movies. I just like looking at it all. I'm just a Christmas nut! Yeah, so that's my answer. I just like looking at everything. But what's your answer? Don't forget to go back to Easter Elf's video and leave a comment in the section below. And if you have a question for us for next week, you might ask it because who knows, we might use it. And if we use it, we'll use your, we'll say your name as well. So if you have a question, just type it in in the comment section below, and we might use or send it, send it uh, to us on the page. You never know. We might use it next week. <laughs> Okay, let's move on along. She talked about the live show. Oh, before that, though, her, no, she talked about a special guest before the live show. I got something special in the mail today since the, since she put up our video. A postcard. And it said, in short, it, 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 I think it might be from our new elf that's coming very, very, very soon that you guys have been asking about. I don't know when he's coming, but... He said he's excited to meet you guys, or he's really looking forward to meeting you. And he asked you if you wanted to meet him a little sooner, and he gave us all a challenge. But it's going to be a tough challenge to beat. He said if we can get over, two, if we can get 200 likes before our next show, 
He might show. He will show up at the live show. <laughs> the only thing is, the live show is coming up really, really, really quick. And I didn't mean. He doesn't mean we have to have 200 from what we have now. It, it's just 200 total. So last I looked, we have 160 likes. So if we can get to 200 likes before Wednesday night, which is our next live show, he's going to be on the live show, and he may even host the show. Oh, yeah, that'd be fun, wouldn't it? But we have to work our tail ends off. We have to tell everybody and anybody and everybody that we know about Santa Shaggy and the Christmas crew, and they've got to come over and give us a like so we can get that like meter all the way up to 200. Oh, do you think we can do it? Huh? Do you think I I can't hear you? Let's hope we can. Um, yeah, and the live show, Easter Elf also talked about that. A good way to get on the live show is to go to blogtv.com and you set up an account, which is really quick. All you gotta do is sign up all the stuff, fill out all the pay, the the thing on the page, and then they will send you an email, and you go to your email, and then you go back and forth and back and forth, and then it'll set up an account, it takes about five minutes of your time, and then the day of the show, right before the show, probably 30 minutes before the show, which I, we're going to try to shoot it at about the same time, shoot for the same time we were last time, which was 8 o'clock Central Standard Time, uh, you go to the page, you find the password, because I'm going to put a password there, and then you come back to the show, you come and you go up to the private chat, which all you got to do is click on my name, Santa Shaggy, it'll be up in the corner. You click on my name, it'll show, get a little sidebar thing, and you click private chat, and you send me the password, and I will give you operation, operator privileges, which means that proves that you're with our family, and you guys get all kinds of special, special things that you can do. If somebody comes in and they're real rowdy and they're not being G, you can kick them. Or uh, let me give you permission. But, I mean, let me tell you to kick them before you kick them. Um, but if somebody comes in and they're being rowdy and using language and all kinds of stuff and we just can't stand for it, I, we may have to remove them, and that's the way to do it with the ops. So if you want operator privileges, or also you may possibly be able to co-host, but you have to be a or have a uh, account with Bug TV. It's as simple as that, and we will have fun, and if we get 200 likes, who knows, the new elf might show up. Mm -hmm. Yes, I hope so. Also, if you guys haven't noticed, a couple, the past couple weeks, from time to time, I will set, uh, put something on the, on the wall, or on the sta uh, status, saying that I'm opening my private chat, and you can come personally talk to Santa Shaggy himself, and in fact, if you have a microphone, you can actually talk, talk to Santa Shaggy personally. Oh, just look for for when I say to come on over to my personal page and give me a private chat, and we can privately chat. Ha <laughs> ha! And we can talk to each other because it's like on Skype, and we can talk that way and have a lot of fun and just be rowdy and goofy and and be silly and all that kind of stuff. And who knows? Well, I've had a couple people do that already. They came and we didn't talk talk, but they chatted on online. So be on the lookout for that, too. It's a good chance to get to know me a little bit better, and I can get to know you, and we can get to know each other, and we can have a, a party, a party, a party. Yeah. But this, like, to wrap this whole video up, you guys know we're a Christmas page, but Thanksgiving is right here this week, and we're so excited for it. So let me say happy Thanksgiving. Be safe out there. Get a lot of tea. Be with your family. Love your family. Love on your family. You never know how much more time you're going to have with your family. Um, just have a good time and know that as soon as Thanksgiving's out of the way, we're going to rock it here on this page. You're going to see all kinds of stuff. You're going to see stuff on a daily basis. You might see videos on a daily basis. You're going to see all kinds of parties that we're going to be doing. We're going to do live shows all the time. Well, I, I will open my chat room from time to time, and we can chat, and we'll just we'll just go all crazy. We'll do the backstroke and all this cheer that we have, and we'll just have a good old time. So be ready, because in a couple days, it's going to be after Thanksgiving, and that means it's Christmas season, and we're going to do a dance. <laughs> so be ready. 
<laughs> That's all I'm saying. Be ready and be merry. And I will see you soon. Shaggy. Oh.